What is going on, guys? So in this video, uh, we're going to complete the Git uh, exercise um, in our HDB Academy module web requests. Um, so let's go ahead and scroll down and jump right in. Um, so go ahead and spawn the target, and then um, go ahead and launch your uh, Kali Linux VM or the instance that you have in HDB Academy. Uh, so the question says, the exercise above seems to be broken as it returns incorrect results. Use the browser DevTools to see what is the request it is sending when we search and use curl to search for the flag and obtain the flag. All right, so first steps first is it wants us to use the browser DevTools to see what the request is uh, when we search, right? So let's go ahead and open up a browser and then go ahead and navigate to your target. So for me, it's 161.35.174.253 colon 31156. And then you're going to get that from the IP listed here. And then go ahead and hit enter. And then the username and password is admin admin. And you should see that right there. So admin and then admin. All right. So now um, we're at this little web application where we can search for a city and it'll provide us results, right? So, um, and they also said this part's broken. So it says, use the browser details to see what is the request it is when sending, a, when sending, or what is the request it is sending when we search. Okay, so what it's asking is, okay, what is it using when we use the search button? You know, what script is it using? Like what, what functionality is it using, right? So let's go ahead and get the dev tools. So that's gonna be hamburger icon, uh, more tools, and then web developer tools. All right, so for instance, if I type in test and then hit enter, you'll see a Git request um, get posted. So if you look in the details, um, it says search.php question, question mark search equals test. So it's okay, well, that's very interesting. So we know that it's using a PHP file called search php and then of course the search parameter um, is test that's what i typed in so search equals test right so when we go open up the command line we're going to use um, this same kind of um, command um, to run our curl command and i'll show you guys how to do that here in a bit um, so you can kind of dig in here um, and see kind of everything so if you go to the response it says please use curl right so um, in order to finish this question, we do have to use curl, but we did need this last part of our command, which is gonna be search.php question mark, search equals test. All right, so now if we go to our command prompt, um, let me minimize that here. So let's do a couple things, right? So if we just do a curl to um, this website here, uh, 174.253 colon 3156. Uh, and you can kind of see I actually have it all, all auto filled here. Um, but I'm going to take you guys step by step of how to do this. So if we just do a curl, right, and dash V, right, um, you're going to see um, just kind of some of the basic he header information. And at the bottom, it says access denied. So we need to provide credentials in order to use the curl command. Um, so that we can run that search function because when we went to the browser side, we had to type in admin admin in order to get access to the tool. Well, how do you provide the credentials using command line through curl? Well, it's pretty simple. So you can just do curl and HTTP 161.35.174.253 colon 156. And then um, you don't have to put the dash V in here. So you can actually just do dash U and that'll supply the username and the password. So the user is admin, and then the password, we do colon, and then the password is admin as well. Then hit enter. So now you can see it actually gave us the web form, right? So you can see body, and then type a city name and hit, you know, enter. So now we have um, access into the tool um, with the credentials. So now part of the um, question, it says, um, use curl to search for flag. So, okay. So instead of searching for any city, um, we're going to search for the keyword flag. So how do we do that? Well, 
up arrow, we'll do use a curl. So now we know the credentials. We know dash u supplies those credentials. Um, now to search for the flag, remember what we did in the beginning was we had to find that exact kind of phrase or that command structure, which was, if you remember, search.php question mark search equals and then we're going to put flag in here right so now when we hit enter voila there is your uh, answer for this module so yeah it's, it's kind of like a building block exercise so you kind of have to do a couple things first right you got to navigate to the browser you have to figure out what the search function is how do you plug that into you know the command line um, then you go back to the command line, figure out how to send the username and password with curl, and then kind of combine everything and then build out your URL, um, which is going to be, you know, the IP and then uh, forward slash search dot PHP question mark um, search equals and you put what you're searching for flag. So we got this command structure based on the dev tools that we were using. And then um, the dash U um, admin admin, um, if you scroll up in the tutorial, it'll show you um, how to supply uh, credentials, um, which is right here. So dash U admin admin. Um, now I put dash U at the end. Um, you can put it in the beginning, doesn't matter, as long as the credentials are right after the dash U. So hope you guys really found this uh, video helpful. If you did, uh, please subscribe. And of course, if you have any questions, uh, feel free to leave a comment below. Uh, thanks for watching and we'll talk to you guys later.